This is the Simpit video blog, and as many of you know, this past weekend, Justin Wilson passed away as a result of his injuries from a race crash that happened at Pocono. It's a very tragic story. My heart really goes out to the family, friends, and, and the fans of Justin Wilson. And I know many people, I met him myself, and I've seen many comments from people on Facebook who met him as well, and he was just... He was one of the class acts of the IndyCar grid, and anybody who ever met him had that genuine feeling that he took the time to really get to meet them in that handshake moment. He was really loved by everybody on the paddock, and that's why if you look through forums, you look through racer-type uh, uh, websites, you see nothing but tremendous love and, and people really having broken hearts over the death of Justin Wilson. That is not the reason I'm here today. I, you know, and, and I'm not really trying to look for a silver lining, and this isn't a, a silver lining, but today his family actually mentioned, it might not have been today, but they released a statement that actually said that he was a donor, meaning that when he died, some of his organs were able to be donated to people needing him. And in this case, six people actually were benefited from the donations from Justin Wilson. And I just need you to understand how important that is. In his death, six people might have had the opportunity to live. And the reason I'm here talking about this today, and I'm getting a little choked up, I'm sorry. It's not, it's not so much that he died and I'm here to do that because everybody talks about it. But if you really want to honor Justin Wilson, why don't you make sure that you're a donor? I'm a donor. You go to DMV, you check the box, and if anything should ever happen to you tragically, perhaps your death could benefit for others. So I'm going to end it right there. Rest in peace, Justin Wilson. You will be missed. You were loved. And uh, this is The Sin Pit.